How well does the Gilmore Heavy Duty spray faucet work? Stick with me in this video, I'll share my experience with you. The Gilmore Heavy Duty has a lifetime warranty. It has eight patterns. It's supposed to have a swivel base that reduces the kink. This moves easily. Here's some manufacturing information. Has a limited lifetime warranty with a contact number. There's the manufacturer's information. The patterns seem to be sprinkle, straight nozzle, full sprinkle, circle pattern. I don't know what you call that star pattern. Flat. And then the shower. And that's what the front looks like. Let's test it. So that's off and on right there. It's pretty nifty. Let's test the different ones. This is the stream. That's the I guess focus strength focus spray. It's round. It has a little leak in it. It's not too cool. Focus spray. Flat. It's leaking up there. I guess it's the full shower. And that's cute. Bubbler, I guess. Soft and mister. Let's stream again. Now I'm going to test it. Just put out some topsoil. Looks <clears throat> like deer have already been walking in my top soil. Some little leaf here I don't think it should have on it. I'm not sure what that's all about. It's easy to use. See how it leaves? That's not cool. still has that leak when it's supposed to be off. That's really not acceptable. Let's see. You can tell how far that goes. Maybe about 12 feet. Uh, maybe 6. Hard to see. 
day. Looks like a lot of spray on my side. And that was pretty far. That's a good long stream right there. Not quite as far. Again, hard to tell. I've seen a lot of mist. Not quite as far as steady stream. Here's the flat. Again, I'm seeing a lot of mist. I don't think it goes very far. In the shower. Not very far. Bubbler. Mist. That one's the one that goes farthest. Not quite as far. Mist. Mist. That's it. Yes. Bubbler. Yes. The stream goes a long way. Not quite as long. This thing really does leak a lot. It's like if I'm watering plants. Look at all that's going to come out all over my porch. I think I'm going to have to take this one back. So that is not acceptable on a water faucet. So for that reason alone, I'm going to have to give this one thumbs down. I'm not sure if it's this name brand or just a particular one that I got. But that's not going to cut it. I did go online and fill out the customer care form on the Gilmore website. I received an email about 10, 11, 12 days later, and they did ship me a new one. Well, look at that. They did send a replacement. I'm hoping this one works better. Nice. I completed the online form, um, told them what the problem was, and sent them a picture. Gilmore did send me a replacement. Let's we'll see if this one has the same issues. Exactly the same. So far, it looks as if this one does not leak. I think I must have just gotten a dud. This one looks fine. Well, it's leaking right there a little bit. Maybe I need to cut it off in between changes. Yeah, this one still has a leak on it. So if you're looking for something that has absolutely no drippage on it, really can't recommend the Gilmore. Just a leak on that one. You see that? Looks like it does do better if you want to cut the water off when you're changing it. And it's leaking for nothing. Not entirely drip proof. Even the new, ha new one has its issues. Well, to be fair, I guess I need to completely cut it off before changing. Stick with the video and I'll show you the different patterns on distance that does do better when the water pressure is cut off.
Maybe it's building up in there when you try to change the spray patterns. And that's what's causing leaks. The water pressure is not quite as strong as the one I had before. It doesn't take off quite as much dust, and dirt, and debris as the previous one did. I guess this is what we have today. Inferior products. I didn't scrub the siding because I was just trying to do a quick thing. And that's the high pressure nozzle. So it's really not going to do anything. Really not going to do much. Really not enough pressure on it. To do much of anything, it will wash off surface dust. preparing to water my porch and it's still leaking. I do have it cut all the way off. It just doesn't have a complete and total seal. It is nice that I can water these almost dead ferns in this distance. Let's have a good pressure and knock over a plant. Take care of that. Fairly decent water pressure. I don't know if the plant can be revived, but that's a nice spray. It is the end of summer. We're spending it on hundreds here. A nice spray. It has a little bit of leaf on it. Thanks for watching my video about the Gilmore Heavy Duty Sprayer. Remember, it's free to like, subscribe, leave a comment. If you look in the text below, I'll have a link where you can purchase one of these. And in the meantime, let's help each other become better consumers. Bye. If you have time before you go, watch another one of these videos. Bye.